This is a Can Touch This video review. I'm Raj, and with me I have Gavin. Hello. And Anthony. Hello. And today we're going to be taking a look at Fruit Ninja, uh, which is a little game that uh, you may have heard of before. And um, they've actually now got a iPad version in HD as well. But this is the this is the iPhone, iPhone version, iPhone version. And yeah, there we go. So basically, if we just go into a new game here, the whole idea of the game is to cut up fruit uh, with your samurai sword. So if I just and you'll see the fruit start to pop up, and you just use your finger to swipe through and cut them in half. Um, and as it uh, goes along, oops, I missed one there. There was a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> that dang coconut. As it goes along, so you get these bombs pop up. You can't that. hit them, otherwise uh, the game's over. And um, you can get combos. Oh, that's cool. So the more that you get at once, uh, you actually get like <laughs> a four or five fruit combo. And you get these little uh, sensei messages. <laughs> and as you sort of progress along and the higher your score gets and the different combinations that you do, mm. you get different uh, items to use, which are back in your dojo. So uh, if you go in your dojo here, because uh, that's where ninjas they hang out. That's right, with the yeah. sensei, which is this old yeah. bloke. So you go in, into your swag, and so you know you got different blades. So it has different colours when you swipe across, and different so, backgrounds. So does the blade get like um, sharper or harder, or better, or is it just like a different graphic? Just a different colour. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it really does absolutely nothing. Mm. But the backgrounds actually help because if you change the. Um, the backgrounds, they sometimes you can see the stuff better. Okay. Um, so, oh, okay. When you select them, when you item, you still have to you still have slice to swipe. it. It's, yeah. not, it's, not, it's not a tap. There's actually, and there's also a, um, there's two different modes. There's the classic, which is what we were playing before hmm. with the bombs, and there's also the Zen mode, which there's no bombs, but there's a time limit. Oh yeah, so it's it, so just kind of a go for as many as you can within that. Yeah, and try and get as many combos as possible. Oh, yeah. it, the more combos you uh, that you get, the more points you get. <laughs> um, and you can use multiple fingers, so oh, yeah. you can do three there. Which uh... <laughs> you just, you just put your fingers all across it, and <laughs> slice so, and dice. It's uh, it's pretty good. It's got open faint. Uh, if you want to track your high scores and things like that, Twitter and Facebook integration. If yep. you want to post your scores to someone, but uh, yeah, it's just it's one of those perfect toilet games. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. It's a dollar nineteen. Um, dollar nineteen. Yeah. What, what, what do you give it out of five? I really like it. I give it a uh, four, close to five, because it's just one of those perfect games that you can pick up and play pretty easily whenever you feel like it. Cool. Thank you, Ren. Thank you.